Hi everybody, my name is Rosen, I'm with Solar Power Store Canada, and today we're going to talk about our 1200 watt solar system that we installed in this coolie right here. Let's get to it! So our system is really made up of three main charging sources. We have the solar panels on the roof, providing about 1200 watts of solar. We have our alternator DC to DC charger, which charges our batteries while we're actually driving on the road. And we also have our shore charging, all monitored by this exact unit right here, and the DC to DC charger at the front. So our system is really broken down into three main parts. We have the accessories with the disconnect switches right next to the batteries on the right side. We have the main controlling unit for the charging in the middle. And then we have our outputs for the DC and the AC on the left side. So right here on the right side, you'll see the first components of the system. First of all, you'll see these batteries right here monitored by this shunt, showing you the battery levels and how much charge is actually coming into the battery itself. Uh, the shunt is installed right here, which allows the screen to monitor all the inputs and outputs of the system. The next part of the system you'll see here is a disconnect switch. This allows you to turn the battery on and off from the rest of the system um, for any, any maintenance purposes, allowing it to work on your system safely. The last part of our system here is our solar disconnect switch. Now, all, each one of these disconnect switches comes with these pre-made MC4 hookups, making them very easy to install and almost have a plug and play solution. Something that you'll notice throughout the system is also our wiring. When you purchase any of our kits, we try to give you as many pre-made wiring to make the kits as simple as possible so you can hook them up as fast as possible without thinking too much. So right here we made it to the heart and soul of the entire solar system. This is a 24 volt 3 kilowatt inverter, an 80 amp solar charge controller and also a 60 amp shoreline charge controller. Basically what this means is this, this unit regulates the charging from the solar and the charging from the shore power when you hook up your system into the shoreline. It's all very easily compacted into here and the wires underneath here are actually very easily pluggable. What you'll notice the way that we set up this system is with these two bus bars, each one rated for about 350 amps, which is more than enough that a schoolie like this would ever need. Our systems will actually come with these bus bars for very easy connections and with pre-cut cables for you to make the connections very easy and simple. What you notice right next to the bus bars is these two wires coming out of here. What those guys are is actually the DC to DC or alternated charger. So when you're driving, this is what charges your battery when you're driving. In your system, you can place the DC to DC any way that you'd like. We just have to run it from the front of the bus where it's right next close to the batteries. We'll talk more about how this part of the system works when we get to the DC to DC charger or the alternator charger. Now I made it to the last part of the system here on the left. What you have here is basically the output of the electricity. You have your 120 volt electronics coming out of here on this out of this AC distribution box and you have your 24 volt electronics coming out of here. Now remember this is for 24 volt appliances. If you are somebody who does require 12 volts, you can buy an additional converter, which you can place right here in between your system and the fuse box to drop down the voltage down to 12, allowing you to use the system for any 12 volt applications that we require. Now here on the left, you have the short charger, which is hooked up from the outside, allowing you to charge this, your whole system off of a 120 volt source as well. So right here, what you actually see is our DC to DC charger. This is what charges your batteries while you're driving. It basically hooks up to your main car battery or your main fuse box, just depending on what is more accessible. And it converts that energy to something to 24 volts so that your main batteries can actually keep charging. As always, we include a fuse in every, each one of our systems. This is, and this goes right in between your main car battery and this unit. It's just a safety point in case anything ever does get overloaded. Oh yeah. So there you have it. This was our latest video about our latest Schoolie install. It is, it is our install of our 12 kilowatt solar system with a 24 volt, three kilowatt inverter, short charger, the whole five yards. If you guys are interested in this kit or would like to learn more, you can visit us at solarpowerstore.ca where we have full details and specs of every piece of the equipment that's included in this kit. If you guys have any questions, feel free to leave any comments that you have or questions in the video below, or you can, con can con contact us through our website at solarpowerstore.ca. Until next time, remember, it's simple, it's easy, it's solar.